Well, hello. <sighs> How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing better. Um, doing good. So, tell me how your weekend has been going. I want to know in the comments below. Let me live through you. I've been at home all weekend. <laughs> taking care of things. But, um, I wanted to hop on here because it's Sunday. And I'm home. And I wanted to go into this bag from Timu. Shocking, I know. Timu who? What? Okay. This bag was delivered, I don't know, Friday maybe? <clears throat> Bunch of holes. Like, it's so taped up, like, everywhere. Like, all this. And then there's another hole here. It's pretty bad. So, I'm, and then this was all split apart. And I think that's where USPS decided to tape it up and say, we're not responsible for this. So, I really just want to get in here and make sure that everything is in here. Um, did I, bring my, I did. I brought my other phone so I can hopefully go through this. Because this has like four orders. If I didn't already say that. Hmm. Huh. It's got four orders in here. So we may get through it <laughs> in one video. It may be two. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Um, so it's going to be a random a random haul of just all kinds of things. So, yeah, I just... <laughs> this is my, my pet peeve <laughs> right here. This stuff sticking out. I just, I can't. Like, I don't know, but... Let's take a real quick... Th what is going on? Why is my hair doing that? Oh my... What is that? Hold on a second, you guys. I just put my hair out of my face, and now it's going to give me problems? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't get mad at me. I just don't want it, like, sticking up. You know? That's not fun. Come on. Get in there. Hold it down. Hold down the foot. Nope, it's not going to hold it down. I don't know where my other bobby pins are, so I'm a little bit bummed out because I can't... These bobby pins, or these hair pins, are not my favorite. <laughs> not my favorite. They don't hold well. I mean, they do if you have thicker hair. But my hair is not thick, so... It doesn't work as well with me. Not to mention they're the wrong color. They're like gold. But it was like advertised as brown. So, I don't know what's going on with that. Okay. Can we just, can we just stay put? No, it's gonna, okay. We're just done with that. Okay. <laughs> <I'm> <coughs> <coughs> Maybe I should start this whole thing over because I'm literally falling apart <laughs> okay Whew. let's let's go let's go we got a timu haul and yeah biggest pet peeve right there because what if it would have fell out look at these look at this just <gasps> anyway timu haul all right i guess we'll start with this what is this oh i think it's hold on I need my spectacles. I cannot see without them. Okay. <laughs> Weeder change how she looks. Lighting conditions affect film colors. Okay, so it's a window film. I believe it's like a stained glass. Oh, I guess we're going to open it up. <clears throat> I like putting window films on like the lower portions of my windows so that I know people can't see it. <laughs> but I like to keep the top ones open, I guess, like without much on there because then I can see out because our house is a little bit up. Okay, hold on. This little thing is taped. It comes with like, I guess I could probably, can I slide it off? It comes with like a little, I smell coffee. I think my dad's making coffee. Okay. Yeah, I can slide off. That makes it easier. Okay. 
So it comes with little directions that is like taped together. I cut it later on how to put this on. I believe it's just with water. Just with water. Oh, it's taped. I guess that's good, but dang it, I'm trying to show people here. Okay. Oh, it is so cool. All right. It's just the stained glass. And also, what I was thinking about, which I think will be really fun, um, is, don't pay attention to the light, <laughs> um, is I was, I have seen people put these on, like, this, the sunroof, moonroof, in their cars, and I believe that is what I got this one for. Because I thought with all the different colors, it would be really pretty shining in the car. And it's not too girly. So when my husband drives it, he doesn't have to <laughs> drive around with something weird. But I don't know. We'll see if this works. I'll let you guys know. I will update you. I will update you with that. Okay. I'm excited. So that one, I believe, is for the for the car. I know I have some coming for the windows. Fur. Fur. <laughs> oh my goodness, you guys. I hope your weekend has been wonderful. Our weekend was pretty good. Um, if you caught my last video, you know that we have some issues with my dad and some memory stuff. And I cannot thank you enough. I'm still responding to comments, by the way. Um, it's just been busy around here. But uh, I took the advice about the dehydration now because he was he had been sick <clears throat> prior. So he had lost a lot of fluids and he wasn't getting as much in. I was giving him water and stuff, but he wasn't really drinking it because he wasn't feeling well. Um, he was sleeping a lot. And then... Um, so that, when y'all mentioned that, it just like clicked. Oh, oh, yes. You know, and I went and I got um, a bunch of like electrolyte drinks and things like that and brought it home. Um, and also about like uh, the other issues, I'm going to mention that to the doctor when I talk to them again on Monday when we set all the appointments because I will request a test for that as well. Um, but yesterday went well. We did not have an issue yesterday. And I'm hoping it's the hydration. But either way, we're going to get all the things done. We're going to get like a CT scan, the nurse had mentioned, um, and things like that so we can see if there's any deterioration because she said that there's medication that cannot cure it, but hold it back a little bit, you know? So keep the prayers coming, please. It's probably going to be a busy couple weeks with him trying to make sure he's okay but he was very happy when I mentioned um, that y'all had mentioned dehydration or possible UTI yada yada and he was like oh so maybe maybe I'm not losing my mind yet <laughs> bless him okay so yeah we've been dealing with all that oh I think in here because I've got some giveaways coming up so there are some things in here for giveaways, and I can't show them. Because they're a surprise. Okay, so, of course, it's like one of the biggest things. We may get through the whole dang thing, because... Giveaway item. Number one. <laughs> that was a big one. <laughs> it took up so much of the bag. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Y'all should be looking forward to it. Okay, what what is this? What is this, you guys? What do you think? If you've been here, you know. More washi tape. Come on. Am I freaking serious right now? How much washi tape does a girl need? So I ran out again of my little washi tape organizers. These, right? Love these. Love these so much. But I have like 20. That's a lot. They stack, but imagine 20 of these. Like, that's a lot. 
and I have them in a drawer and then I have the ones that I use the most on my craft table which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 of them. It's a lot. But um, anyway, I was so annoyed because I realized I have washi tape coming and I had just gotten like washi tape. Anyway, long story short, I wanted to find another way to store washi tape that I could, you know, interchange them because you can change out the washi tape with this, you know, you just take it and you open it up and you could take things out. So I figured I was going to make something handy and I'll put a picture here. Look at how cool I used some, um, what are they called? Uh, curtain rod hooks or whatever, and they stick. So no nails, no hammering, and they are strong. I cleaned the wall first with alcohol, let it dry, let it wait, all that stuff. And then I hung them up after kind of measuring where I wanted them. I'm looking at them on the wall right now, if you're wondering what I'm looking at <laughs> while the picture's here. But um, anyway, then I was able to get some dowel rods and I just went to Walmart and I bought a bag of dowel rods. <clears throat> and I think it was under two bucks. I'm pretty sure it was under two bucks because I was pretty stoked at how um, inexpensive it was. And they're just 12 inches long and they're just this size. And I hung the other washi tapes that I didn't have a place for. <laughs> I hung them on those too. So I have more dowel rods that I can add more washi tape on that area of the wall. I'm gonna have to move those decorations. But that's okay, I'll find a place. That'll be my washi wall. <laughs> washi wall <laughs> so here's some more washi tape for the washi wall now this one I was really excited about and let me tell you because I love everything vintage why do you attach it like that I guess it's good but gosh darn it um I love everything vintage when I'm doing my crafting and stuff and this just has such a vintage aesthetic here and I was so bummed because they sold out while they were in my car. And I was so annoyed. I was like, no, not those. I wanted them. Because just look at, oh, I almost dropped them. Look at the cuteness. Look at these. How stinking wonderful are these? You got like, oh, it's upside down. Yeah, okay. Like a ruler or a measuring tape. Thing. And then we've got just like vintage text, you know, maybe like from a newspaper or magazine or something. Oh, jeez, I almost dropped it. <laughs> um, another measuring tape. See, these are just so cute, right? Oh, they would be so fun. And then look at this one. I love this one. It's like the typewriter. The old-fashioned typewriter keys you know the round ones and then we've got just like different different text on those I'm so stinking excited I love when they come in these little boxes too because I have a place to put them and keep them until I can put them away and now I'm so excited but I need more of those hanging things because I don't have any more. <laughs> I'm so mad about it. But um, that's okay. I've ordered more and actually they have shipped. So I don't know. Probably like a week I should get them. I ordered 12 more. So that'll be six more rods that I can hang on the wall. If that isn't enough, then I have way too much washi tape. I mean, come on. Oh, wait, let me tell you how much that was. Sorry about that, you guys. Hopefully I can find this order quickly, quickly. And if you like my earrings, I hauled these in the last haul. Aren't those cute? Look at those. Oh, I love them. They're so fun, and they're comfy. 
It's hard to find the order. found it. <laughs> 172 is what they are right now. So, sorry. Okay. Let's go. Now, like I said, this is multiple orders, so it's probably going to be all over the place. Um, actually, I got some new jeans, and they're from this order, so... <laughs> And all the prices that I put up on the screen will be the current prices as of filming on Timu. Now, prices may vary, okay? They are constantly doing things. So, and with that being said, within 30 days of your orders, remember to always check for your price adjustments. Because if it does go lower than what you paid within that 30 days, you get that back. But you gotta request it. So, okay got a pair of jeans and I got these in a size 1x Ooh, okay so we'll see and I liked them because they were supposedly like a um, you know a bell bottom or whatever and they had a distressed bottom which I like I like that <laughs> I don't know why I do and it's just a blue jean it feels really nice I'm excited. They actually look like they might be long enough. But these are nice. They have a good stretch. That's a good stretch. So I should be able to fit into those. I just hope that they're long enough. That's my only ever problem. But yeah, these are cute. I'm excited. Try them on and I'll insert a little picture or video or something. Something. I'll do something for you. But yeah, these are cute. And they don't have a smell. Are we just lucky? Yeah, no, they don't have a smell. Okay, cool. I'm happy about that. And right now they are $17. Oh, no, that's what I paid. $17. They are, oh, no. My respect Oh. They are $15.98. Go, go get them. <laughs> They look real cute on the model. So, we'll see. I don't think they'll look like that on me. But you never know. You never, ever know. This is a different order. Hold on a second. Don't get too excited. Oh, I think... Oh, this is bad news. I think this is part of the order. It's a shirt that I was so excited to get. But why is it just smushed in there like a return? Look at even the... Come on. Even the paper is crumpled. The paper that's supposed to keep it from getting damp. It doesn't have a smell like the last... Look at this. Excuse me. I don't want returns. You know what I mean? Okay. No, this is a skirt, and I don't think this is in this order. I thought this was a shirt, but this is a skirt that I've been waiting on getting, if it's the right one. Um, I ordered a 2X, and it's just a gray, it's just kind of like, I wanted to wear it around the house, to be honest. It's got pockets, okay. It's a nice material, and it's just, it just goes down, it's got those big pockets right there and it just comes down 
lots of space, lots of room. Um, I like the way they have it styled on the model. I think that's really cute. They have it tied. I don't think it's going to be that long on me. But I like the way it looks when it's tied. But that's also how it would look. But it's cute. So, I'll try that on. That's nice. At least it's not damp and it doesn't smell. And <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. I mean, does customs open up the clothes? I would hope not. Um, so it's eleven sixty nine right now. I guess I'll pull this out because, ugh, and it's discontinued anyway. Okay. Well, anyways, um, this is for junk journaling. And I paid Oh my god. Hold on. Usually I tell you what I paid. I just realized I've been telling you like the current prices, which is fine, but I usually tell you what I paid and write the current prices. But I didn't pay for this. This was free. <laughs> um it was probably one of those buy two or get two free items when you spend forty. So um this yeah, this is for journal making, and I thought this might be fun to try. I've seen other people use them, and if you've watched my journal series, you know sewing in can be quite stressful. But look at this. I'm so excited. So it comes with the board, the twine, like some little thingies, you know, the and all. But this is... A board that you can put the paper on and then you can lay this on top of it and those little things right here lock it in place and you can easily punch your holes in for when you sew. You don't have to measure it. You know? <laughs> this is so cool! So I've seen this. I want to play with it. I want to try it. Yeah. I'm excited. Okay, let me put this in back. I'm definitely excited to play with that. I've been waiting for this to get here. But yeah, I thought that was free. I love when those things pop up. Like buy or buy forty dollars and stuff and did I tell you what that I didn't tell you what that window cling was oh my god it's discontinued so it doesn't matter but I paid 548 for that okay next these are not in this order or that one okay maybe this one it stamps yeah this one is okay these are like They're supposed to be like the cup rings, you know, like you're drinking your coffee and it dribbles and you put it on your paper and you get that, that coffee ring. I mean, in what land? Fairyland? Who's drinking out of that cup? What is that? What is that? I was so excited for these. <laughs> well... I mean, still, they'll be fun and fine, but literally not what, that's not going to work for what I planned. I mean, I can still use my coffee cup and still just dress it that way. I know, but like, this was supposed to make things a little bit easier. If I can get it out of the bag. But it does have little, like, splatters too, which is nice. I freaking love it though. That's funny. Timu cracks me up sometimes. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not bad. Oh my goodness. That's funny. Um, I paid one eighty for that. And it's two ten right now. It's called Coffee Dot. Where? I still wanna know where. Oh my god. Okay, I like playing with makeup. I went to cosmetology school when I was 17, 
and I did all the things, but I never went to go take my test because it wasn't an area that I didn't like, and I was nervous, so, because you had to, like, go and spend the night. I was young, okay? I was young. So, anyway, um, <laughs> I never got my license to do cosmetology, but I still love it, and I play with makeup all the time. I love to do hair. I used to do all my kids' hair as they were growing up. Um, I used to color my girls' hair all the time and all that stuff. Anyway. So I thought this would be fun because, you know, sometimes people like to put fake um, freckles on their face, especially like during the summer. You see a lot of the younger girls doing that too lately, but um, I've never done that. But I thought it would be funny when I found this. <laughs> you can't really see because they have this stupid label on it, but <laughs> freckle tattoos and there's six pieces. So I can freckle my face six times. I just thought, oh my gosh, this would be so funny. It would be so funny. Oh, and it's by Eel Hall. They've done a lot of, they do a lot of like cosmetic stuff. Okay, so there's that. The picture, it's got six pieces. Are they all the same? I wonder. Let's see. Oh, how wonder, wonder, wonder. Ooh. Who wrote the book? Ah! Of love. Stop screaming. Yeah, they're all the same. They kind of remind me of a video game controller. <laughs> anyway, that's what they look like. So, it would just go over your nose and, like, on your cheek area like that? Really? That long? Like, what is that? Maybe... Oh, yeah, like this. <laughs> you put it on like this. And you probably would use water. And then you have freckles. I don't know. I thought that'd be fun. You could do this in a layering, like um, put it on to your clean face. Or if so I don't wear, um, I don't wear foundation or concealer. I only put a little bit of powder on this um, this area here, this area, this area, and this area, and then I put blush on, and sometimes I wear eyeliner and lashes, and then I wear chapstick. So, like, what I would do, what, this is what I would do for me, um, before I put the powder on my face, I would put the freckles on, after I've had my face clean, I would put the freckles on, and... Then I would, after they're dry and set and everything, then I would do my makeup. And that way, it's layered, right, under the makeup. Because nobody's freckles are above their makeup. So, <laughs> anyway, I thought these would be fun to play with. And I would love to put them on. Maybe I'll do a little short where I'm putting them on. And you can see how they look. So, okay, what is this? Ah! Uh! Okay, hold on. So, did I tell you for the freckles I paid one sixty one? Okay, I got another set of that washi because I must have been freaked out that they had sold out so fast. And I didn't want to be without it. <laughs> I must have really liked it. Okay? Alright. What is next? Another stamp. And this one I believe was a circle freebie actually. Yeah, um, it was a circle freebie. So I did not pay for this. This um, right now is like 176 And it's just um, florals with butterflies. Just a uh, clear stamp. It's got some like clocks, birds, and like text behind it. So it looks kind of like a layered like collage type of thing and it's five different stamps that's cute that's cute and it's not a bad price 176 oh goodness 
And if you don't know what Timu Circle is, Timu Circle is this little program that they offer. It It's a like a per month fee. Um, or you can pay for three months, I think, at a time. And you get coupons. And you get dedicated customer service. You get credit back on your purchases, um, sometimes up to 8%, um, depending on what how much you spend. Sometimes it can, I think it can get up to like 10%, I think. Um, but it's a max of $20, though. So I placed a large order recently, and back in the old days, <laughs> it would have been a lot of credit back. But um, I only got $20 of it, so the credit back was equal to like 5% or something. Anyway. Anyway, that's what Timo Circle is. And you can also get two free items a month. Although I've seen other people say that they get like multiple, like three or five items a month. So it could be different. And they sent me uh, an additional three free items this month. So... And you save a little bit of money. They have discounted items that you can get to, the Timu Circle discount. So it is fun. I mean, I think you pay, what is it? How much is it? $3.99 or, let me see. Put on my spectacles. Because if you wanted to use it, I've been trying it out um, for a couple months and I'm happy with it. And I'm probably going to pay for it again. Okay, so I know they give special deals, but okay, so it says like they're offering me three months for $9.99 or one month for $3.99. I've apparently had Circle for 123 days, so four months, and my total savings have been $170.82. I've gotten $122.34 back in credit. Um, I've got um, $9.00 savings from the coupons. I've got three dollars of saving three oh eight in circle deals and I've um, got thirty six dollars and forty cents in free items in that hundred and twenty three days. So I mean that's kind of worth it <laughs> right for like ten bucks and I saved a hundred and seventy dollars. I mean you know so Timo Circle is interesting and you can find that in the the U area of the app and then it'll be usually up at the top or you maybe you can do a search for it but I'm not positive because it popped up as an option for me okay back to the holly hall all right which order are we getting into now what is what is that what is going on with this this is just I don't know I don't like when things are shipped to me like that I, I really don't Okay, so this is just a small little crop top. And I ordered this to go under, like, as layering in the, like, with the little jumper that I got with the suspender kind of thing. And then the dress, the black, the simple black dress. I thought this would be, the color is what sold me. Because I was like, this will be great in fall with that little dress. And if I had, like, stockings on and stuff with boots, you know. Luckily, it doesn't smell. It is so crinkly and wrinkly, but it's soft. And look at that. Isn't that cute? And it's got the lettuce, like, hem, you know? And it's got the little, it's a little bit longer in the front, and it comes to a little point. And then there's the back. But it's nice and thin, too, so it is good for layering. But... <clears throat> if you don't like your arms, like, I hate my arms, you guys. <laughs> because as I'm losing weight, my arms are just getting flabbier. And they're terrible. But I don't care. I still want to go out and I still want to look pretty and I still want to wear things. <laughs> so, but I got this because, look, I probably could have gone a size smaller, actually. But so it will hide some of my arm and I can feel comfortable. And, you know, you can dress up things that you didn't think you could wear, you know, because it doesn't have sleeves if you don't like your arms little thin crop tops like this are good for that so i'm happy with that actually i'm not happy with how it got here but <laughs> happy. um let's see what did i pay for it 
I paid six seventy eight. So yeah, right on. Okay. What else do we got? What else do we got? Another giveaway item. Shh. See, those giveaway items are probably going to be why we might make it through this video. What is this? I don't know what this is, so I can't even tell you. Maybe it's moissanite because it says white golden. Two carrots. I don't know. It comes in like a little drawer box. <laughs> I'm definitely not in this order. Did I get something fun? <gasps> I guess I did. Oh, it's a necklace. Oh, it's so cute. Okay. It's a little skeleton key necklace. And it is moissanite and it is super cute. I got it free. So. It was that same order where I got that book binding thing free. So this was one of the items that I picked. Because I spent $40? Yeah, $40 and you get two items free. Okay. Look at that. Isn't that stunning? Oh, look at that sparkle, you guys. Oh my goodness, I'm already wearing a necklace and it's gold. This might not work because I haven't had a necklace on. And what is going on? Come on. <laughs> it was a little tangled. This might be on the same level. Maybe if I do it tighter. Let's see. My hair is in the way. Of course it is. I'm choking. Hello, hair. Come on. I'll make it longer later, but that is cute, you guys. Look at that sparkle. Definitely needs to be longer. Oh my god, it's choking me. Ah! No! I don't like it. Okay. Where's the little thingamajigger? A little bit longer. You know what's funny? This has a key too. Can you tell I love keys? <laughs> it's still a little bit tighter, but, uh, or still a little bit tight, but I can get my finger in there, so that's better. All right, I like it. I'm happy with that. So that was a freebie, and what is it now? Please don't tell me it's discontinued, because I'll be literally so sad. Nope, it's 11.19 right now, so not bad. Not bad at all. Look at that. It's so cute, you guys. Mmm, it's so cute. Okay. Wait, hold on. I'm going to loosen it one more time because when I get excited and my neck gets all tense, the necklace gets tight. Great, now I took my hair back. That's cute. I like it, you guys. I like it a lot. Okay. Yay. I like that it came in a little box. Although, you know what? It wouldn't have been nice if it would have come in one of those little pretty boxes. The ones that you can see in. I like those. I've been going for 40 minutes, you guys. Okay, this is a stamp. <laughs> Not one of the clear ones. And it's supposed to be like a music player. So you can write, you know, the song or put a picture or something. And then, like, the song name, maybe a picture. Like, say it's your wedding song or something like that. You can put a picture of your wedding after or where you're going to stamp and the name of the song. And I don't know. It's just kind of fun for journaling. I thought it would be neat. It is really packaged up, though. Let's see. Okay. Ugh. 
I'm probably going to stop the video soon because it's already at 40 minutes. And you know, I've noticed in my algorithm that most everybody's kind of done watching in about 20 minutes. So I think I've overdone it already. But because I still got a good bit in here that I can probably put into an order, into a video. Yeah. You could do that. That one's a, another giveaway item. Yeah, okay. Let me show you the stamp. Oop, okay. And it's got the wood. So it's a wooden stamp. And there it is. Isn't that cool? I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, yes. Where is it? That one is not in that order. Not in that order either. Oops. It's there. I paid 142. And it's only 139 right now. Okay, let me see. What do I got here? Okay. We'll, uh, we'll do the other stuff in the next one, and it'll be a fun one. So, I got I got a little bit in there. Okay. Anyway, I hope you're having a fantastic Sunday. I really, really do. And if you're not, I hope it gets better for you. Um, try to stay lifted in the positive. And, yeah, so I hope you're having a fantastic morning, afternoon, evening, whatever it is, wherever you are. I hope you make it a good one, a happy one, a blessed one, and a very fulfilled one. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now. <laughs>